Hello everyone, my full name is Nguyen Thay An. I'm a 5-1 student at Ngo Quen Primary School in Vinh City, Vifu Province. Since I was a little girl, I have been fascinated by the traditional culture of Vietnam, especially the art of water poetry. Today, I would like to share my understanding of the water poetry art. Water poetry is a unique, creative, a rich form of art that represents the cultural tradition by combining singing, dancing, storytelling, acting, and humor. Water poetry creates fantastic sound and visual effects on the water surface. Water poetry is a traditional folk stack art born more than 10 centuries ago from the civilization of the very evil dead to rice culture. This form of art is often performed on special occasion, village festival, joyful day, and during death. Water poetry has become an intangible cultural heritage of Vietnam and was recognized as a UNESCO cultural heritage in 2012. A water puppetry is an impressive spectacle achieved by combining the following elements. First of all, puppies. Puppies are often made of lightweight, boiling wood, float on the water surface. They carved with distinctive lines, polish, and decorate with various colors to enhance the character personality. The puppy shape are often vibrant and amusing. The puppy's body, which represents the character floating on the water surface, while the base stays submerged, serving as a support and housing the control mechanism for puppy movement. Secondly, music. Water poetry performances are, comp are accompanied by traditional music, instruments such as monocart, moonshell lute, bamboo flutes and drums, along with unique melodies, create a distinctive musical atmosphere, contributing to humorous and dramatic situations. Next, performance. Puppeteers controlling the puppies must possess acting skill with flexibility and precise hand movement to create accurate and delicate gestures. They also need to express the emotion and personality of each character and the facial expressions. Moreover, script. The story's performance narrates photos and the daily life of the Vietnamese people, including common activities like farming, frog catching, fox hunting dog, dragon dance, lion dance, wrestling, martial art, and buffalo fighting. Some escapes include classical tales such as Thaik Sang and Tam Gap. Last but not least, costume and setting. The performance takes place on the water stake, known such as water puppy theater or tweeting. Resembling a large shrine in Vietnamese temples, the surroundings are adorned with flags, fans, elephants, flags, and get hangings. On the stake, wooden puppies bring the story to the life, controlling of puppeteers using a system of poles and strings. Water poetry performances are complemented by the sounds of drums and the fireworks. As you can see, only from live loads of wood, our forefathers put to life into the puppies, making them lively, charming, and full of vitality. That is the genius of ancestors' intelligence, creativity, and the valor of the Vietnamese people. If you visit Vietnam, remember to enjoy the water puppet show to understand more about the culture of Vietnam. Once again, my name is Thai, I'm from Vinh Phu. Thank you and bye-bye.